Okay, the Us trailer came out today, the newest Jordan Peele horror movie. And because, you know, it's Jordan Peele who also did Get Out, there's probably going to be some kind of cultural or, like, social commentary. So let's take a look. Let's see what we've got, what he's got in store for us this time. That's a classic right there. What does I Got Five on it mean? It's about drugs. It's not about drugs. It's a dope song. Don't do drugs. Get in rhythm. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Can't believe how big Dave got. Did you hear Gabe got a boat? He's kidding, right? He's not kidding. Hey, I think it's vodka clock. Oh, yeah. Where's Jason? Jason? Jason! Where were you? I didn't know if you were lost. Stick with me, and I'll keep you safe. There's a family in our driveway. It's probably the neighbors. But y'all scared of a family? Hi, can I help you? Zora, put your shoes on. If you want to get crazy, we can get crazy. What are you people? It's us. They look exactly like us. They think like us. They know where we are. We need to move and keep moving. They won't stop until they kill us. Or we kill them. I'm not sure what to make of it. I mean, it's definitely a horror movie from that trailer. Or is it? Because when I saw Get Out, I guess Get Out was in the horror category, but I almost thought that it was kind of like a comedy sometimes. I mean, because, I don't know, I was never really scared watching it, but, you know, of course there was, you know, life and death situations and intensity and things like that and social commentary, you know, on being a black person in America and stuff. And this movie looks like it might have some of that because I don't think it's an accident that he has, you know, a black family coming to visit you know, their white friends or whatever, like having, taking a trip or a vacation with them. Elizabeth Moss plays, you know, the, the Caucasian lady who's friends with Lupita Nyong'o and Winston Duke. Um, you know, and she's, Elizabeth Moss, I think is, that's her name, the star of that Handmaid's Tale um, show. Like, she, that's, that's this actress. And so I'm wondering if this movie is going to have the same kind of social commentary or, you know, Maybe another kind as Get Out did, because I don't think it's an accident he has a black family vacation with a white family, and then some bad stuff start happening. You can't tell what it is, but I'm sure there's something going on with that. And then, you know, they get attacked, or by, you know, I guess, deadly people who look exactly like them. And the people menacing them are also, you know, black people. So, I'm not sure what's going on. I can't tell, if the, and you know, they look like them. They're like, you know, bad reflections of themselves. They're us, you know, the name of the movie is Us. So, you know, I can't really tell. Maybe some of you, I mean, I don't get what the connection is and what's really going on here. But, you know, there's probably some smart twist or whatever that has some social commentary about society and maybe black people in America, maybe in relations between black people and white people or whatever. Because like I said, I don't think it's an accident that this happens when this family is staying or visiting their white friend. So, you know... Some of you may be more astute than I am, and you know what the connection is right there, right away. Um, I'm not sure, though. Oh, we did see that one scene where Elizabeth Moss, she was, like, brushing her hair, and she had scissors with her or something, making it seem like she was in on it. But maybe that was just a scene of her, you know, brushing and stuff. There was also that scene of her where she was crawling on the floor, bleeding. So maybe she's a victim as well. 
or does she just want to make it seem like she's a victim? So, I don't know. Good stuff. And Lupita Nyong'o and Winston Duke, you know, of course, they're also from Black Panther, so I guess they're working together again. You know, um, Lupita Nyong'o played um, Nakia, and Winston Duke played, I forgot his name, but he was the he was the leader of that other tribe they went to to try to get help to fight Killmonger later on in the movie. And so they're working together again on a Jordan Peele horror movie, which will also be good for their careers. You know, being in Black Panther was also good in their careers too, right? But you got to keep that momentum going as an actor in Hollywood. So what did you think? I thought it was good. I didn't think that it was necessarily scary though, like I said, like any other trailer. Like more scarier than other horror movie trailers I've seen. But again, I see horror movies all the time, so maybe I just have kind of a tolerance a lot of this stuff. But what did you think? Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like it on YouTube and subscribe to the channel because I appreciate your viewership and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.